Hello, YouTube. I'm back. <laughs> Here to do an on two unboxings and an unbagging. And the first thing I'm going to unbox is from Amazon. And I've been waiting on this. I know what it is. Cut myself with this knife. <laughs> I um, ordered me some uh, Tahitian vanilla bean moisturizing shave oil. I had just the regular, and uh, I was watching uh, um, Jessica Braun, yeah, <laughs> and she had mentioned something like this, and I use a lot of tree hut. I I do use their, you know, body scrubs and uh, their shea butters, and I, I like I like these products, and so I'll be ready to. I'm ready to use that already. So, <laughs> and then the next box is I uh, signed up for the allure box and this is my first one um i hope it's awesome Yeah, I haven't never had an Allure box before. This is my very first unboxing. <laughs> it's a, well, it looks like this, like that, has a, Lure Beauty Box. Um, uh, I started a, well, I made me a YouTube page to watch videos in 2013. And I guess it tells you everything it's got in it. Beauty videos and music videos and a belief stuff like that to not all the way full apparently so <laughs> let me see if I can find that in here yeah belief says belief the true Cream, Aqua Balm, Aloe Vera. When it comes to my hair, I've been slicing open an aloe vera leaf to relieve its slimy goodness as a step in my wash day routine for years. So you put this in your hair? Mm. Full size price is thirty eight dollars for this. I, I follow her. On um, let's see. She's a, she's a beauty guru. She goes by Abadabs. And then there's I just got done watching her nails. 
dashing diva. She pretty much fills gloss ultra shine palette. And These are where's just, just like salon nails. Mm. And I don't do my nails. So Maybe I will now. So I've had my nails done before. And yeah, I'll I'll probably try these. It's a vitamin C all day eye cream. Uh, where has this slightly cooling, never irritating eye saved your been all my life? <laughs> I wouldn't think about putting like vitamin C on my eyes. I mean. You know, the citric, citrus acid is, oh, I'll, I'll give it a try. <laughs> and then, Shane Perry Gold Black Pearl Eye Mask. Huh. Is in my experience, eye masks are either pretty, say in fancy metallic shade shades, or they work great. But these Shane Pre masks are both effective and Instagram worthy. <laughs> they are made of black hydrogel with gold shimmer and soaked in essence made with glycerin black pearl and gold extracts they're in 20 minutes these patches clear up the puffiness oh, i need that from whenever i wake up i've got puffy under eyes <laughs> and uh Supposing this I is Yensa product. It, it says sometimes, you know, graceful it's beauty. And I'm not feeling good. I, I don't really talk a whole lot and stutter with my words and can't remember shit. Rip it open. <laughs> can't, can't get it open. Oh my God. And, and I hate that. I really, really hate that. You know, Oh, that's pretty. I just want to be it's a super super eight lip oil. It's really runny. The doe foot on it's not too big, but it sure is pretty. That was so hard to open. I ripped it. <laughs> oh my! And then well, it doesn't have this in there, but it's by Tarte Rainforest of the Sea. Color Splash Lipstick. 
in cruising. Hmm. That's awesome. Oh yeah, this is pretty. Very pretty. I like that. <laughs> you hear my video from the other one i'm watching it or listening to it anyway but yeah this is a real pretty lip color very pretty and then dang one last thing it's tony moly intense hair gold 24 karat snail hydra gel mask let me see what the I know it sounds gross and sticky, but this sheet mask is infused with snail mucin. Shockingly, the slimy stuff feels heavenly on hot summer day. It's cooling and hydrating and immediately plumps my skin. Plus, there's a real benefit to snail mucin, a popular K-beauty care ingredient. It's a complex mix of peptides, anodoctants, uh, glycosam, glycan, I can't pronounce that, so, and then hyaluronic acid, zinc, copper, iron, and magnesies. Uh, yeah, rest of them big words I just can't read. So, but this was the last in the box, so it's a gel mask. I'll have to try that, and and it is kind of funny thinking putting some snail on your face. <laughs> But, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's funny. <laughs> and then, since I got the two boxes open, I have a bag from Sea Color Cosmetics. I was online yesterday, or not yesterday, but a few days ago, really, because I was trying to, I was, went to Urban Decay to look at their cherry, or naked cherry, and I knew that uh, a lady that I watch which is her name is Hot Mess Mama, MD, meaning Makeup Diva, does, is it a dupe or something like that? And so I was trying to compare the palettes and, you know, have them side by side on my laptop and, and they wrap mm -hmm. them up really good so they're safe mm -hmm. but I'm telling you it mm -hmm. is really identical to the this in here is called cherry 
12 uh, color eyeshadows by C Color Cosmetics and they are identical. I, like I said, I was comparing the Naked Cherry palette to this Cherry C Color Cosmetic palette and they are very uh, and that smells like cherry too so but yeah I'm gonna be trying this palette out real soon it's real pretty and it does look like the Naked Cherry by Urban Decay and it even comes with the brush so I'm happy about that but yeah Got a heck of a deal. Saved a lot of money. <laughs> I mean, they're identical. I mean, shade for shade. And, and I'm pretty sure that she has, well, she, it's called, is it a dupe or a waste of money? So, yeah, that's, you know, she does those, and this here is, like, really spot on, so I am glad that I got that, and I hope that, uh, they can come up with some more dupes. I've there's another company. It's only got four palettes now, but they do dupes too. Uh, mainly, I think of Natasha Denona, but they're pretty good. Um, so I've got all four palettes no, of those. But I think, well, I only paid like with shipping and handling, I paid $12 for this. And with the Urban Decay Naked Cherry, it would have been more, so. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with this little, little bitty haul I got here for un unboxing. I got my Amazon box and got the Allure box. I know this is a slug crush from Morphe, but it does not have... And yeah, I'm just pretty happy with that. And, and, and yeah, I've got the Urban Decay Naked Cherry Palette. Oh, yeah. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the, the unboxing and... I'll see you guys the next time I put up a video. Maybe in a couple of three days I might. And I don't know if BoxyCharm ever sends me my June box. They June premium box they keep telling me they're going to send. Well, actually they've said twice and then wanted to know. First time they sent me a deal and told me that they had a box ready and they would send out a shipping number. I never got the shipping number. And then I went to my uh, bank account and looked up to where I had paid for my base box and my premium box because they charge you separately. They don't charge it all together. And so I highlighted all that and then I, you know, copied and pasted it to an email and told them that I want that money back because I didn't get my box. It was stolen and uh, ain't no one out here where I live going to say, oh yeah, I, I stole it to you and want it back. <laughs> no, they're not. So, I mean, 
Yeah, it's sad that there's thieves and stuff, but, you know, it was FedEx's fault, and BoxyCharm needs to get someone else to deliver their stuff, or a lot of people's going to be mad, because I know there was two times that if... Uh, my son uh, hadn't been here, well, not here, because I, like I said, you know, he helps out here, and he's seen, you know, the FedEx, and because, and he knew, he knew I was expecting a boxy charm, and uh, he come and asked if I had it, and I said no, and he said, well, he FedEx guy just left, and. I got up on on got online to look and it said it was delivered and so he went to look for the box and it was in the building uh, uh, south of me and he brought it to me because you know it was my box it had my name on it and then with this last box uh, it got sent to another box was kind of southwest of me and it, they said they gave it to the customer this last box the premium box uh gave it to the the customer which it said it was apartment three well i don't live in apartment three I live in building three. That apartment three is a building one. So that's like one, a, one building one, and there's over here on the others on the south side is building two. This building I'm in is three, and so forth and so on. I mean that's how it goes. I mean there's sixty units out here and. And I know they keep telling me that they're going to send it. I know I got an email the day before yesterday, or maybe it was yesterday I got it. But I did not open it because I just knew what it was going to say. And then they send me an email and tell me, uh, <laughs> sign up for BoxyCharm and you'll never miss a June box. Well, well, I'm sorry. I have unsubscribed to them and I won't go back. They need to, they really need to make up to that. Uh, they need to keep their word and, you know, I see on, you know, it's not the people that, you know, go out and, you know, do this, you know, look for sneak peeks and stuff. It's not their fault. And people shouldn't go on the people that do sneak peeks and gripe them out that, you know, hey, I didn't get la la la, you know, or anything like that. I, I had seen that on my Instagram whenever, because I uh, follow Glam with Suzanne, and she does the Boxy Charm sneak peek too. And even on her own platform with Glam with Suzanne, they were telling her, you know, why didn't I get this? Well, it's not Suzanne's fault, you know. It's customer service, support system, FedEx, you know. And, you know, BoxyCharm needs to make amends with all of the things that they've let people down on and I for one am really let down and I was so let down that I did unsubscribe to them and I will not if they want to make it up to me maybe I'll I mean you know they tell me they're gonna make it up to me well they've told me that twice this last email been is the second time the first email uh, I didn't get anything, and you know if they're gonna, you know, keep telling me that stuff, uh, 
why resubscribe, you know? <laughs> and, you know, if you want to leave a comment about how you feel about it, and leave a comment, tell me what you think. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, hit that little red bell twice to make it gray and get all my uploads and just uh, now, have a great morning, oh, evening. I'm going to be up for a little while because my sensor on my heart is fixing to go dead and I'm going to have to charge it. So, but anyway, y'all have a, a, a good night and just... Peace out. Peace out. <laughs>